Yo, YouTube. I just wanted to give you an update. Because I haven't vlogged in a long time. Because I've been busy. Um, I have my own things going on. And, um, as you can see, I have my hair cut. Um... I had it done before my birthday. I I am now thirty two years old. Yay me. Um I got some teddy friends that are more than teddy friends. They um they're from Build a Bear and they have my family's voice in them. Um because right now when I can't see them all the time, um, I need to hear their voice, basically, since I live alone. I know I have support, and I know I can phone them, but it's not the same. I, especially my Manchester family, um, they're really busy at the minute. Anyway, um, so yeah. Um, I also got this big hoodie, red hoodie, um, which is fluffy, um, because I have a second hoodie that's got like a cuff here, which I'm going to get rid of, um, because this red one that I treated myself to um, looks so nice and feels so nice that I sometimes can't wear it because I get too hot. Um, what else did I get? I got myself a DS. With some games and some styluses and a charger. Uh, because um, I sit and somebody stole the other one. So I had to, to, I had to buy another one with the games and styluses and everything. Uh, I've got some plans coming up. Um the um the only plans I've got this week is my checkup tomorrow, um, which is Friday. Then oh, this chair is really comfortable. Oh yeah, I treated myself to a new chair. Because the dining room chairs I've got gave me a bad back. And I and it's only just now, two weeks after sitting on that chair for about five hours, that it's only just now getting better. So, uh, that can't feel it. So, yeah, I've got a, um, that's why I treat myself to this chair behind me. It's a desk chair. So I can do Zoom again on Monday. That's one of the reasons why I didn't go this Monday. It was because I didn't want to sit in that chair again. I'm a bit traumatised. Because I don't want to get back back again. But this is really comfortable. Um, this wasn't a birthday present. This was because of my bad back. It, it's the only way I can do Zoom now. What else? Um, next week is a busy week for me. Because I'm going to see a lot of people at my mum's house. I'm not staying over again. I'm coming straight home. But it's my uncle's 60th next week. Um, is it next week? Because it's the following week. It's the 5th. So it might be next week. And... One second. What date is it today? Look, look at my laptop open. I need to move you along a little minute. 27th, okay. Three more days. Three more days until it's my best friend in the whole world's birthday. And I'm older than her. <laughs> Only by two years. Anyway, um, so I'm going to be seeing all my cousins again, hopefully. Um... Just 
I'm going through so much right now. That's why I haven't put. That's why I haven't posted. It's because I'm going through a lot right now. It's one thing after another at the minute. Um, I didn't want to post while at mum's because I was busy at mum's because I was at my mum's for my birthday. Um, before that, I was too depressed to do this. Um, but now, I'm completely honest, I miss talking to you. So yeah. What else has been going on in my life? Apart from going to my mum's and having my hair done. I'm going on holiday in about two months. The first holiday I've been on for two years. The last holiday I went on to was when I was in a relationship in Ireland. This time I'm going to Skegness with my mum and my nephew. It's never been the three of us before, never. And I'm really looking forward to it because I've never had quality time away from Northumberland with those two members of the family before. So I'm really looking forward to it. I said to my mum that I'm going to request 200 because this is the way I do it with my money. Um, because I have struggled with my money, I have to admit. Back when I was able to look after my money, um, it was gone. Like, it ran through my fingers. So then we had to go through the whole, my card was stay in a money tin. And the only people that had a key to the money tin was my support and my mum. I was not allowed a key. So if I wanted anything, I'd have to have my support. Um, can I get it out while I have you? But the annoying thing about that is I didn't have them every day. So if I fancied chips that night and I didn't have the money on me, I couldn't get chips that night. So, yeah. Because I didn't really want to bother my mum. Because my mum was living in Newbegin at the time and I was living in Ashington. So, yeah, that was a problem. So that didn't work. Then we had the whole I got my own money situation. And it just, I ended up going in debt. But not like bad debt, well, they got it sorted. They just let me have money that I couldn't even have. Um, so the way I do it now, it's a thing that if you live in Northumberland, um, they do. It's basically County Hall gets all my money. All my benefits, everything, they get my money. And they pay the majority of the bills, my rent, my utilities, um, any other bills I want them to pay. And then I get my weekly allowance of 120. For about a year or two, it went down to only 80 a week. Um, because I kept spending it on somebody I shouldn't have spent the money on. That's there because my hair's messy. Um, so, but now it's went up to her, went up to 120 again. So, I'm busy sp spending 30 quid of the Tuesday, because I get paid twice a week, um, on a Tuesday and a Friday. So the Tuesday money, half of it, goes to mum to pay for this, the chair. And the other, it's just plate money. Um, but then the Friday money is my shopping. Because I go shopping with my mum. Which hopefully should stop. Hopefully in the next couple of months. Because I can't wait to go my, with my support in, her, in the boss's car. We were just weren't allowed to do it because of COVID. And being too close together. But I've had my both vaccinations... And I can handle hand wearing a mask if I have to. Um, and I won't mind being in the back if she's in the front driving. I don't mind. I just miss doing my weekly shop on a Tuesday with my support. Because now it's housework. 
anyway. Um, money. Budgeting. So yeah, County Hall looks after all my money. And I get my weekly allowance. But if I need anything, for instance, the DS I bought myself, I ask for the money and they, if it, they'll check so you've got it. And they'll be like, yeah, sure, here you go. And they give me the money. I'm not going to go crazy with this, with the other money, which I don't want to. I don't want to go crazy with my other money. Because I did last, I did two years ago. Two years ago? Two, three years ago. Because my uncle was up. And he basically decorated this whole, painted this whole house again. The whole flat he painted. Um, apart from that, I've still got that on my wall. Um... What else? Oh yeah, I had to get money for my IKEA unit. Um, and the removal man. So yeah, I spent a lot of money that year getting things taken away in the rubbish. I got, and then I then I bought then I bought the IKEA unit because I needed storage. Um, I I still need to buy some more drawers because the drawers in my kitchen are broken. Um, what else? That's about it, really, to do with this flat. Um, apart from that, oh yeah, I might need to buy a new light bulb soon. The annoying kind. The long kind, because of my kitchen being one of those long kind of light bulbs. I wouldn't even know where to get it from these days. <sighs> I've been doing some serious thinking. After the bit, um, because I'm expecting a niece or nephew. When they're born, uh, I'm thinking about getting rid of some stuff after they're born. I'm only thinking about it. For instance, I've got a pram there and a stroller there. I'm completely honest, I only use the pram when I go shopping. I don't think they're alive anymore. I don't think anything's alive. I think I believed that. To make to make the certain somebody happy. I've been doing a lot of soul searching and realisation. In the two years, I realised that I need to get rid of a lot more. I've got an eel there, big eel. They're they're going because I had to. Just recently, I did a sacrifice of my puppets. I'm getting rid of most of them. Um. Then I'm going to have to have a serious think again. Um, if I want to buy any more teddy ferns. Because I'm thinking about changing. Because I used to be... My go-to thing to treat myself to is a teddy fern. But here's the thing. I'm thinking about something else now. I'm so house proud now. I'm thinking about buying things for the house. Can like, I don't know. I need to buy some drawers. That'd be nice. If I could afford it, I'd buy a, a new shower. Because that only comes out a certain bit. I won't want to come out longer. Because I have to go close to the wall. Um... I would upgrade my cupboard in there because it's a mess. I'd actually put some nice storage boxes in there because um, at the minute you got all that's in there is Christmas as well as up there. Christmas and memories and a tent. That reminds me, I need to get rid of that tent. I, I bought that tent 
because I used to go to a place called Tokunatsu down south. But I'm never going back there again. Because it's too far, too expensive. And none of my friends go there anymore, so I'll be alone. So. And last time I went, I didn't really enjoy myself. So that's why I need to get rid of that tent. You know what I forgot to grab from Mum? Which I don't have to now. Um, the other bed. Because Mum's got my other bed. Mum's got my other bed. The one that you plug in to blow up. Because um, I've given her the pump one. What I might do is tell her you can keep it for uh, in case she needs it, and then ask for it back after the party. So she's got an extra bed if she needs it. I was going off for my house, but I need my house as my haven. I've requested money for taxis, um, because I did put something on fa on Facebook about Amble to Blythe. And I love it. They're quoting me between 20 to 35. I'm like, that is good. I was expecting 30. Um, so I am excited. But I'm nervous at the same time because I don't know if they've all had the vaccinations or not. Even just one vaccination. I don't know. Because um, I've had both of mine. And it's scary being back together again. Last time that happened, I felt like, oh, my nana. <laughs> we made up. We did. We made up. But I felt like, oh, my nana. Um, I love my mum. Because I've noticed. She knows me more than I know me sometimes. She, because I've noticed a couple of times, I think I'm fine. But she can tell. It's either my tone or my walk. But she can tell. She pulls me to one side and suddenly, she says, Emily, you need a time out. I don't think I do. But I'm glad she suggests it. Um, because I do. Because after it, and I've had the time out, I feel better. But at the time, I don't think I need to. But she must sense it, that I need a time out. Because I do. I do. As soon as she says it, I do the time out. And you know what? I need it. Because my time out space at the party next week, it's going to be mum's bedroom. Because Uncle Stephen is taking the spare bedroom. Um, so my haven is going to be mum's room. But hopefully I shouldn't need it. But if I do, it's mum's room. Say, oh, wherever I go, if I book in anywhere or see anywhere or go, basically go anywhere, you'll notice that when I do that, I um, check. See if there is an org room, I call it. And if there isn't one, I go outside. If there isn't an, a room I can escape to, it could even be the toilet. As long as I have a room I, to calm myself down, I do. And um, so, whatever, but because when we go to Butlins, when we go to Butlins, the way we're doing it, as we go down Friday, and we're going to stop off of York, because Mum doesn't want to do a four-hour trek all in one go. So we're going to stop off in York. Um, Mum and Ethan are going to have a look at the Viking Museum. I've been, because I went with college. Because um, we also went to the Real Museum as well, which I found boring as well. But, yeah. 
and because I went to the Viking Museum, and I'm not good for museums anyway, or galleries, I'm going to be dropped off, hopefully in the town centre, um, and I'm just going to look in the shops. And then we all arrange to meet up at a certain point, and I'll, and, we, and then we'll go to the hotel, but I might text mum um, if I can, because I might go to the hotel before then, um, but that might mean I might need mum's card when I've booked it. Um, because we've got three separate rooms, um, so I might have a look around town, then check it, because I'll get bored, um, because I'll get bored, um, easily, so I'll check in, I won't have any bags with me or anything, it'll just be my bag, um, handbag or bag um, with my bank and mum's card information and everything um, and then mum will text me when she's at the hotel so I can meet her outside to take my bags because I just want to take one bag because the other bag is my te will be my technology stuff and I won't need that just for the one night um, because I'm taking both my Switch and my DS. So, um, we check in. Well, I'll check in first. Then my mum and Ethan arrive. I'll help them with the bags. They'll check in as well. Then we go to our rooms. Then decide, after we put our stuff in our rooms, what we're going to do for dinner. Um, no. You get dinner included. So we'll decide to meet up at such and such time for dinner. Then we'll go back to the hotels and just relax. Um, and then arrange to meet up a specific time in the morning for breakfast. Um, and then we go the rest of the way to Skegness to the hotel, to the Butlins. We can't check in until two, I think they said. So it'll be a late start heading off from Premier Inn in York um, so then mum drives us all the way to Skegness um, we check it we, we do whatever the Butlins tell us to do we go to the hotel well actually it's actually an apartment it's actually an apartment I get the double room um, Ethan and Mum get the two twins. And, um, I'm sorry for rambling. Honestly, I am. I'm just going to call this update ramble. It's up to you if you watch it all. So, oh, what was I saying? Oh, yeah. And then we just relax. For a couple of days. Because we come home. Monday? I think we'll come on Monday. Um, so I won't have any outreach on that Monday. I won't be doing Twist and Ducks that Monday. Um, I'll be back, I think. I can't remember. I just can't remember. But it's, it's a good couple of days away. On the way back, we're not going to stop by York. We're going to go straight home. But we are going to be stopping at services. So I'm going to stretch our legs. I can stretch my legs and Ethan can as well. Um, on the way back, and there we go, and that's my holiday, and I'm really looking forward to it. I bought some new clothes, so I'm going to be wearing that for the holiday as well. So I'm going to take so much new clothes with me. I'm not even going to wear jeans. I haven't worn jeans in years. Jeez, sorry, blaspheming here. Um, oh yeah, this Sunday I'm going to have a pizza, because another group I do called Splinter, they're going to have a pizza evening, um, so I get free pizza from Pizza Daddy. Um, next week, 
when I have when I order my own pizza from Pizza Daddy, which I have to pay for um, on the Friday. Because the rest of my family who are up for my uncle Stephen's birthday, they're gonna have take out at my mum's. Oh, crisp. That's crisp on the floor. <sighs> anyway, I've been rambling for way too long, so I'm gonna call this update ramble. Okay. I've gotta come off anyway, this battery's on twenty. It's probably less than that now. Okay. We've got to this far, thank you. Don't forget, like, comment, subscribe, alright? I love yous.